I'm happy enough with the out wide. I'm not going to touch his player progress or his player proficiency. So what I am going to do is um is just turn him into a really kind of different, unique player than what I have, right? What's the crack, lads? Welcome back to Dream Team Chronicles. We are back in business. We've got a beastly squad as we always have here, playing with our normal 5-2-3 into our sub tactic which is a 3-2-3-2. Three, two, three, two. Now, I have a couple of changes, right? There's a couple of changes on the squad, um, and we're going to have to train up Guti as well. So we actually got Guti. If you missed out that, hopefully you can hear me as well. Um, if you missed out on that pack that I did, I think it was in the last episode, I think I got him, I got him pretty much um, with the free spin, and he looks insane. So we're going to go back out, we're going to train up Guti, and then we're going to go back in to eFootball League. So we are actually safe in Division 3, um we need what four points to get up to promotion we five wins out of five if you've missed any of those episodes over the christmas period make sure and check them out because they were quite good we're finding a bit of form um but yeah we'll see how it plays today man every game is different so first we're going to go out and actually train up Guti and get him into the squad and see what he's like all right lads so he takes 108,000 trainer xps it's just quite a lot right it is a lot but his stats look insane man i'm gonna be playing Guti in a kind of an advanced role obviously his stats are kind of different in uh no matter what way you look at it but we have a couple of different ways we want to train him if we want to train him um like you know we're not going to be able to get that defensive engagement up or that aggression up there's no real point in training him that way uh especially as he doesn't have any um defensive stats there's no point trying to turn him into a Goretzka you know we have Goretzka for that we have a load of different players so I'm happy enough with the out wide I'm not going to touch his player progress or his player proficiency so what I am going to do is um is just turn him into a really kind of different unique player than what I have right so pass him we'll leave that at four at the moment we'll leave that at four I usually start by putting everything four or eight and then see where it lies I want Guti to be able to come on. He's probably not going to start for me. So if I am going to be bringing him on, I'll just bring that aggression up a little bit there because he does have a lot of points. But yeah, mostly I'm going to want, you know, to be able to shoot with him, um, to be able to have that in his arsenal because Goretzka is good to shoot, but it's it's more kind of manual. Um, passing needs to be obviously going to be high because that's what he's going to be there for. Dribbling needs to be high. I think 90 ball control is probably enough. Um, I am tempted to get up his speed and his stamina quite a bit as well because I do want that offensive awareness up. So I'm probably going to go 12 on two of those, uh, which is 89 acceleration, uh, 88 balance and 84 offensive awareness. So that should help his dribbling as well with the balance. Um, and then, yeah, probably just go with that. I think go with that uh, or maybe even put one more into passing. 85 low pass is actually is actually quite decent and then we'll probably just put one in to strength as well to get his physical contact i think that's the best version of him let me know what you think obviously the acceleration is quite high but i want to balance the offensive awareness up um but yeah i'm happy enough with that player 95 overall so we're going to see how he plays hopefully he'll be up in this match all right let's we're into a match hopefully we can get a win here and that would leave us with one point that we would just need then this guy's using tottenham's kits uh, so we're going to go to white kits. These are new kits I'm using. Actually, they were recommended. I have another video for top kits to use in eFootball, part two. Uh, so let's see this guy's squad, man. He is rocking Mbappe, non-meta teams. But we'll see how it goes. Messi, lovely touch from Messi, as I like Guti already. Oh, he's looking sharp, Kimmy. Swing it in. Oh, man. Why did... Akalele. Not used to shooting. Maybe he should shoot more. Neymar. Oh, man. I need to score early. Hold on, Guti, boy. I need to score, man. I need to score. I should have scored there. I should have scored there by right. Oh, Maldini. Is this what you need to do if you're playing a five at the back, lads? Romario. Oh, I need to score like early doors oh no don't get a better chance and I'll finish that one he just gave me a goal just a runner from Makalele boy oh he's flattening me already Romario and the, or the second goal is there we're not saving those finesse shots but I get way too much space on the ball lads goes long get up Carlos one of the best jumpers in the game see Mario 
Too much space for Mario, and it's three. What a goal. That's why he's the best in the business, lads. But in fairness, look, I'm not going to say anything against this guy. His team, he's playing with a practically a, a really, like, um, I'd say a new team. Um, oh, there's a lot of lag there, man. I hope this guy doesn't cheat me. Loss. Bang. Oh, man, the double post. Okay, we got the win. We got the win, lads. We got the win. Thank God. Arascaeta, Pogba, Pedri. It's not a great team. He's got epic d and goals. He's got uh, Mbappe, Del Piero up front, obviously. But this is the team we're rocking. He's dragging me out of position, lads. And I don't like that. Come on, Mbappe, quicker, buddy. That's bad, man. That's really bad. Back them up. That's a super ball. Lele. Oh, how am I off there? Super, super laggy. Not even laggy, just like unresponsive. All right, good. That's better now. Don't be showing off. Still my ball. Messi. Oh, come on. Messi, come on. Great ball. Goretzka. Lads, there's something feels off about it, though. My first touches, man. I don't know. It feels super, super weird. Goretzka feels like he's, like, level 45 overall or something. It's weird. I have to concentrate for two seconds. Pass out there. Surely not, man. Oh my god, man. This guy is playing super weird. Goretzka, what are you doing? Man, a Goretzka. <sighs> no, man, there's something wrong. There's something wrong, man. There's something wrong. Trust me on that. There's something wrong, man. There's something wrong with the connection. Goretzka is literally like a 40 rated player. I can't move. I have no responsiveness with All right, we'll test Messi. Messi! Sneak it in. What a save, of course. Oh, my God, man. The ball is just not coming anywhere near me. No matter what I do. I'm literally intercepting so many of them, and it's just not working. Back off me, go on. Back off me! Boom! Back off me! Amazing when you get a bit when you get the first goal, lads. Bappe! Ah, oh, come on. It just seems very slow. Now Messi. Messi! He's unreal. He's unreal. Lionel Messi with the right foot that time. Since I changed him over onto that flank, lads, he's a different, different class. A different class. Come on, boys. We're up to Division 2. That's a huge win. Huge win. Two matches to go to get to 50. We get up. 10,000. 8,000. And we're going to get the, the 2,700 eFootball points as well. Seven wins, lads. Seven wins from seven. That is good. We will skip on and get into Division 2. Come on, boys. Come on. That's huge, man. Division 2. And we're going to kick off. We need another seven wins, basically. We need seven wins and a draw. So we're going to kick off in the next episode with another match. And uh, yeah, that's it for me, lads. Weird couple of games, but we got there in the end. I will see you guys in a bit. Don't forget to subscribe if you're enjoying this series. And I'll talk to you in a while.